My name is Kenny Hunter. I'm a sculptor who's been commissioned to create a memorial for the Royal College of Surgeons in Edinburgh. This memorial depicts a group of NHS workers finishing a shift on a COVID ward to mark the compassion and resilience of NHS workers. Kenny gave me a call and asked me about my experiences of working on the COVID front line. We talked about how COVID had impacted healthcare professionals. We talked about the real camaraderie, particularly in that first wave that we had. It was very important to speak to NHS workers because I wanted to hear their testimonies. I wanted to hear the impact it had on their life, how it felt as an individual, how it felt as to be part of a group. It was a complex set of emotions that I wanted to distill into the work through facial expression and body pose and just how I handled the material. So when I saw the sculptures for the first time today, I mean, I was really blown away by them. I have absolutely no doubt that this is going to be one of Kenny Hunter's seminal works in, in the whole of his life. I, I don't see how you could have done it any better. We were incredibly honoured that His Royal Highness uh, Prince Charles came to the college today to admire and, and open uh, Kenny Hunter's wonderful uh, sculptures. He was incredibly open and friendly with everyone. I think that every person felt that he made an effort to speak to them individually and get to know them. We've had a wonderful day today because we have celebrated the royal patronage of Prince Charles, Duke of Rothesay, who is to be our royal patron. He has taken over from his father, Prince Philip, who was our royal patron for 66 years. He loved the college, he was fascinated by surgery, and I think that the Duke of Rothesay felt that he wanted to be part of all of that. He knew how much the college meant to his father, and I think that meant a lot to him, and that is why he agreed to take on our royal patronage.